Welcome back to Skibbity Tech. In today's video, I will show you how to install Feather Signer in iPhone or iPad without computer and without jailbreak. Let's start the process. First open this website and then hit on the con DNS old link and then hit allow to download the profile. Now open the settings, then open downloaded profile and then simply hit install to install the profile. Now open the website again and then hit on the top, signer download, then scroll down and hit one of the Feather Signer link to download Feather Signer app. If one link don't work try the next link, in my case the third link worked properly. Now hit on the downloads and then hit open and then hit install to install Feather Signer app in your iOS device. Once you have Feather Signer app installed in your device, now simply open Settings, then open General, then open VPN and Device Management. Then open the Enterprise app, and then simply trust the developer to let Feather Signer app work in your iOS device. Now open the website again, and then download one of the certificates. I am going to download the second certificate, the Tiawan Digital Certificate. Once it's downloaded, now simply open your downloads and then hit on the certificate to unzip it. Then you will have new certificate folder with three files in it. Now open the Feather Signer app and then hit on Settings, and then hit on Add Certificate. Now hit on Add Certificate, then first hit on Import Provisioning File, and then second P12 Certificate File, and then choose the files from the Unzip Certificate folder. Then enter the password and hit Save. But as you can see this certificate showed me that it's expired, now I will try the other one. Simply go to the website again, and then try different certificate, this time I will try the third certificate. Download the certificate again, and then simply go to your downloads, and then simply unzip the new certificate. Now open the new unzip certificate folder, and there you will see also a complete list of new certificates as well. With their files and password and mobile provision file and P12 file as well. Let's try to add the certificate again. Open Feather Signer again, and then open Settings, and then hit on Certificate, and then hit on Add Certificate. Now I will use the first certificate from the new Unzip Certificate folder. Then add both files, and then write the password, and then hit Save. As you can see this certificate shows 29 days, now simply hit on Certificate to activate the certificate. Now you can install any IPA file you want to install. Simply download your IPA file and then open the Feather Signer app again. Then hit on Library and then hit on Import. Now choose the IPA file you want to install. Once it's imported successfully, now hit on your imported IPA file and then hit sign. Then hit on start signing. 
Once it's signed successfully, now hit on signed IPA file and then hit install. Then simply hit install to install your IPA file in your iOS device. Once your IPA file is installed, now simply open Settings, then General, then VPN and Device Management, then open Enterprise App, and then simply trust the developer to let your app work in your iOS device. So that's it for today. Hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.